improved top tens without a doubt, offer camp enthusiasts unparalleled convenience and endless possibilities for adventure. They can be quickly and conveniently installed on the roof of your vehicle, eliminating the need to set up cumberstone tents or search for suitable camping locations. In a previous issue, we discussed how to choose the right tent and the important considerations during the selection process. In this edition, we focus on how to install a rooftop tent. First and foremost, you need to ensure that the tent you choose is suitable for a vehicle. Take a note of the vehicle's size and height, and ensure that the roof has sufficient structural strength and stability to support the weight of the rooftop tent. Typically, vehicles such as SUVs, off-road vehicles, trucks, camper vans, and some sedans are suitable for installing a rooftop tent. Each vehicle roof has a weight limit and some sedans may not be suitable for larger or heavier rooftop tents. Read and understand the installation manual for the rooftop tent, familiarizing yourself with the installation steps and required tools. Clean and inspect the vehicle's roof, ensuring that the surface is clean, smooth and free from any noticeable damage or corrosion. Once these preparations are complete, you will also need to install roof bars or roof rack systems. Roof bars serve as a primary support structure for the rooftop tents. They carry the weight of the top of the tent and provide stability by attaching to the vehicle's roof or roof rack system. And it helps to keep the overall structure of the rooftop tent stable, maintain the shape and tension of the tent, and ensures that the tent remains balanced and supported during use. Some roof poles are designed with adjustments that allow you to adjust the height of your rooftop tent as needed. This allows the tent to adapt to different vehicles and usage scenarios and provides greater flexibility. Roof bars are typically made from lightweight and high-strength materials, such as aluminum alloy or carbon fiber. These materials provide sufficient strength and rigidity, while reducing the overall weight of roof bars. Some vehicles come equipped with roof bars, while others may not have them. For vehicles without roof bars, there are a few considerations to keep in mind when installing them. Ensure that the vehicle's roof has a strong structure with sufficient weight-bearing capacity to support the weight of the tent. Consider whether the vehicle has a fixed roof structure. For example, convertible cars often have retractable or foldable roofs that can't accommodate roof bars. Check if the vehicle's roof is flat. If the roof has noticeable indentations or slopes, it may affect the installation and stability of roof bars. If your vehicle is confirmed to be suitable for roof bars and you're not confident in installing them yourself, it is recommended to visit an automotive repair shop or dealership to have them professionally installed. They have experience and expertise to ensure proper installation and alignment providing you with peace of mind and ensuring the safety and the stability of your rooftop tent setup. The installation method of roof bars is also an important consideration. Some roof bars need to be securely attached to the vehicle's crossbars or mounting points. These roof bars typically come with special mounting systems that allow direct installation on the vehicle's roof, providing stable support points. On the other hand, there are roof bars that can utilize frameless installation systems such as suction cups or clamps. These installation methods do not require existing crossbars or mounting points and offer more flexibility in terms of placement and adjustment. With the sturdier roof bars in place, you can now proceed with the installation of the rooftop tent. The installation process is quite straightforward. The bottom of the tent is equipped with a high-strength composite board and dedicated clamps that securely latch onto the roof bars. Simply tighten the screws to fasten the tent in place. Lastly, it is crucial to ensure that the rooftop tent is firmly secured and free from any noticeable looseness. Double check the tightness of the screws and confirm that the tent is securely attached to the roof bars. This will guarantee a stable and safe setup for your rooftop tent adventure. Indeed, there are specific considerations for different vehicle models when installing a rooftop tent. Here are some common examples. Compact cars typically have lower roof load capacities, so it's crucial to pay special attention to weight limitations when selecting a rooftop tent. Ensure that the chosen tent does not extend the vehicle's load-bearing capacity. When installing a rooftop tent on a compact car, it's necessary to use roof bars or crossbars to provide additional support. Opt 
for a rooftop tent specifically designed for compact cars, usually smaller in size and lighter in weight, making installation relatively easy. RVs typically have larger roof space that can accommodate larger rooftop tents. However, installing rooftop tents on RVs often requires the use of specialized roof support system to ensure safety and stability. These support systems are designed specifically for RVs and provide the necessary reinforcement for the rooftop tent installation. Pickup trucks and trailers typically have high roof load capacities, making them suitable for installing larger rooftop tents. They often come equipped with roof racks or crossbars that can be used for mounting rooftop tents. Additionally, you can choose to install a truck tower system, which provides robust support for the tent installation, ensuring stability and safety during your adventures. Most SUV models have higher roof load capacities, allowing for the installation of larger rooftop tents. Some SUVs come equipped with roof bars or crossbars that can be used for mounting rooftop tents. If your SUV doesn't have them, you can choose roof bars or crossbars that are suitable for your specific vehicle model. These accessories can be easily installed on SUV's roof to provide the necessary support for the rooftop tent. Once the rooftop tent is installed, you can embark on a new adventure. Living in the city became a very normal thing. Looking for jobs and for more job opportunities, we all get caught up in an urban life. And we forget the existence of nature. We forget the feeling of spending a weekend in the nature, far from anxiety of everyday routine. Camping allows you to reconnect with the nature and to find inner peace that is often overlooked in the city. From my perspective, immersing oneself in nature is truly enjoyable. I love making food on fire or watching the sky that is full of stars. But living in a city is definitely difficult because you're just surrounded by skyscrapers and your routine is so much work, trying to see your friends, trying to finish all the work at home. As a result, I greatly cherish all the moments when I can escape the urban and hustle and just enjoy the tranquility of the nature. During holidays, I make it a point to utilize my free time by visiting a nearby camping site or to go hiking. I really love all the sounds of the nature, the beautiful sights. It does inspire me to be better with my meditation and yoga to calm down, but also even with my work, because once I come back to work, I feel that I'm more creative and ready for a new routine. Already very young, I showed some interest for camping. And my first camping definitely to this day stays the most memorable experience. Me and my niece, we bought all the camping equipment. We bought the tents and other gear that we needed. And we went very far. Do you know how far? In our backyard. We set up everything during the day. And when the evening was starting, we decided to stay outside. The night was already very dark and very deep. Let's say we were camping for one hour when we started shouting and calling our parents to come and save us from the dark, but it was a very nice first try and we definitely tried again later. Although I was still lacking experience, I decided to go for my second camping trip. This time it was with my friends and it was a long hike. I was already a little bit older and we decided to go to a big hike to see beautiful sceneries. And that's where we decided to do our camping. It was very rocky ground and that's the moment when we realized we forgot our mattresses. So sleeping there wasn't the best experience, but spending time in nature with friends was definitely experience and memories I will never forget. By chance, I learned about rooftop tents and I was looking for some professional advice how to choose a perfect tent for myself. It has indeed bought me a better camping experience. I no longer have to worry about whether the chosen campsite is suitable for setting up a tent or if there are any objects like rocks that can damage the tent. I also don't have to worry about the rain because it's definitely not gonna enter my tent. I can go camping whenever and anywhere I want and also I know that will save a lot of time just by the assembly. In the camping trips, I encourage many unexpected experiences, but I managed to overcome them each time. Gradually, my mindset became more accepting and flexible, and I really don't get anxious over minor problems anymore, and I don't get upset over some problems or angry with my companions. Instead, I approach problems with a calm and composed attitude. This is also reflected in my daily life and my work. In fact, I'm actually very grateful for all the changes that camping has brought to my life. In the past, 
people would pitch tents primarily for survival in the wilderness. However, nowadays people set up tent to immerse themselves in nature, seeking inner peace and the liberation of their free spirit. I hope you too can cleanse your soul and experience more wonderful and unforgettable moments during this process. In the next episode, we will share with you some exciting stories of exploring the nature and outdoors. If you did like this video, make sure to give it a like and make sure to comment. And if you're somebody who likes adventure, make sure to subscribe to our channel. We will be here in the next episode. See you soon!